All right, so we're here in Atlantic City. We're cleaning out this house. Not everything goes, but we just came across a crazy umbrella. And I wanted to show you guys what I found. What'd you find? So I was in here and I was like, oh, this box looks interesting. Popped it open. This little tin. <gasps> that box is really cool. I was like looking in here and look. Special detective badge. Oh my gosh. Yes. That's, That's pretty detective. cool, right? Yeah. I like that. <laughs> yeah, that'll get you out of a parking ticket. <laughs> you know. I won't lie in this world, man, you need school. What you saw is what you reap. The price of even making it, you know it's not cheap. Never mind the lights, you can sacrifice sleep. Put your best out there, see results in a week. Breach. I don't think they know. What is up, everyone? Welcome back to another clean out video. So, if you guys are new to the channel, I'm Tucker. I'm Sammy. And we do a lot of clean out videos. Uh, we started doing this, these jobs and filming them and we realized a lot of people online like to watch them. So, we're gonna continue the trend and here we are in Atlantic City, New Jersey. I'm not sure if it's this entire house, part of it or what, but the guy who owns, I think it's a split house. I don't know. I was seeing that online. Yeah, there's a bottom a middle and maybe a top either way this guy that owns a real estate company locally around here basically wants us to go in here and take all the furniture out of the house and either sell it or do whatever donate it get rid of it uh so he can either rent it or sell it i'm not really sure i don't ask that many questions but this is the spot we're waiting for him to get here so he can meet us and we're looking at the job today might take a few things um if it's looking like we can start today we will if not we're probably going to come back tomorrow and start hoping the rain holds off I hope so. I so, hope so. If you like these videos, stay tuned. So there's a good like eight out of ten chances that there's lacquer furniture in here. And you know what that means. Cha ching. I don't think there's lacquer in here. This is the kind of style that dude. It doesn't look like lacquer steez. This looks like, like Yeah, but this looks like somebody who was I know what kind of steez this is. There was a they could have been a balling ass person this is like back a, in the day and then this downgraded is be carpeting downgraded to a smaller house wait no because this isn't he did he rent this out or he bought this he owns it so would there be carpet in there this is gonna be stinky i already know what kind of furniture do you guys think right maybe antique-ish i know that's gonna be like wood furniture that's what wood? that's the vibes i'm getting woodsy i'll bet you five dollars it's gonna be a fun game if we keep doing these i'll bet you five dollars there's play. lacquer furniture in here of course there's gonna be wood furniture. What do you That's mean, of nice. course? How could there not be? What yeah. if it was just the wrong house? And he's That's like, oh yeah, I own those five. <laughs> it's, it's that one, actually. All right, they have blinds and curtains, so. And for a second, I just looked over and I was like, wait a second, is that a cat door? But it's just a pot. I can't see very well from here. Oh, there's a cat in the back too, I got excited. It's just made, which one? Is it the middle or the bottom? I'm hoping it's not the bottom. I don't like If the it's the bottom, video. there's nothing cool in there. Or we oh, could, you know what? I'm thinking, I'm, I'm, getting like the, I'm getting the creepy leather. The knitted blankets vibes. Like those itchy blankets that everyone had because I had a, quite a, a creepy too when I was leather sectional couch that had like, had like wear and tear all on it and like worn down. Do you know what I'm talking about? It smells like yesterday's trash. I'm thinking it's gonna, obviously going to be dusty. No smoking, though, because there's an oxygen thing on the door with the nose. And if it's if it's that unit, how many? Hey. How are you? Good. I left to check at the office. Oh, it's all right. No worries. It's tomorrow. not a big deal. I just leave the door open. Okay, I didn't know for sure if it was this or the bottom. That's the only, that's why I didn't just... Both. Well, no oh, it's deal. both. Okay. I didn't want to walk in on someone like eating dinner or something. No worries. Okay, we're gonna get rid of this entire room except for the printer this. and that. Okay, but everything else goes. Okay. Uh yes, 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 yes. Um all right, cool. Including this too, right? Yep. Uh that goes. Okay. I came over here and kind of bagged up the trash stuff for you, a pile of trash. This thing goes, I'm assuming, obviously, right? Uh, we're gonna keep that. You're gonna keep this? Yeah, I'm gonna try okay. and summer rent this joint out, so. Um, this all stays, because my daughter's donating this stuff to charity. Okay, this is trash. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Trash. Oh, 
trash. Couch. Couch we're going to, I'm going to try, I, I think I need it for the summer. Right? And the side tables and the lights stay. Yeah. And those stuff stay. So basically just, just this. Just this pile of trash. And then, okay. That I'm pile just trying of trash. to yeah, get it in my head. It's cool, this pile of trash. You want to take some photographs? Oh, yeah, I'm actually filming a little bit just so I can rewind it. All right, cool. That's pretty much um, how This I whole roll. back, this whole back really section is trash. Really. Maybe we should just take pictures, though. Yeah, let me see. You got your phone? Just take pictures of everything he says trash. So this stays, right? Yeah. All that stuff? Yep. Stays. So the whole back room, the two piles in here, pile one, pile two, the whole front section. Night vision goggles, man. Pretty cool. <laughs> That's right. They, they are night vision. Here you go. That's this ridiculous, trash. right? Uh, no, no that keep stays. That, okay, so this, 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 this. Uh, that corner, vision. and then that whole room besides the uh, table that the printer's on. The right. table and the printer. Okay. Cool. This goes upstairs, right? Uh, what? This, can you get upstairs from this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna go oh, upstairs. Okay. I was wondering. I didn't see the steps. How you been, man? Good, really good. Cool. Yeah. Cool. How's your brother? He's good. Yeah, I think he's in weird. California now. He's in Cali? Yeah. Sweet. He goes everywhere. Yeah, I know. He's all over the place. Trash? Oops. Sorry. Uh, trash? Trash. Oh yeah, we got a light. Trash? Free like Tim ten Mancuso. Uh, this one piece is trash. get up there from here huh? you can get upstairs from down here all right yeah it's pretty minimal yeah, it's, not too, it's not awful uh, uh bust up whatever you want to bust up bust it up in the driveway uh you can pull up on the curb or you know whatever you need to do it's is it like an old tv <laughs> what yeah if you want the old tv you can have it i mean that's like super just, old it's so classic Right? So, yeah. Like, can you believe people used to have that? Yeah. Isn't it's it wild. nuts? It's kind of cool. Like three though. channels. Right. Black and white. I think it's cool. It's like and art. It's like the dials, dude. That's art now. That's what I'm saying. VCR. It's kind of cool. I mean, when I did that, but we can get like we can get stuff. like a um like a truckload of stuff now and then. You want to do that? Is that cool if we take stuff now and then we'll come back tomorrow and we get it? We didn't bring the trailer, but... Yeah, no problem. If you want to load up stuff now, if you want to do the whole thing tomorrow, if you want to schedule it for Saturday, whatever whatever you want. I think tomorrow might be the best for us. Okay. If that's cool with you. Yeah, tomorrow's just fine. Yeah, don't uh, go crazy tonight. Um, You can pick... When you're buzzing tomorrow. through town tomorrow, swing into the office, there's a check... Nice little backyard, some bamboo. Not bad. The Airstream. Yeah. How cool is that? That's fucking cool, dude. Who's, what, were they I living like in that? that? It's brand new. Let me see if I have the keys in the car. That thing's sick. All right, we're about to get a tour of this thing. Oh, I guess this is he his. He's one of these. So this is his. He just leaves it here. <laughs> He's so funny, dude, that he did that. I know what he does in here. Dude, this thing's freaking sick. What? Complete tour of the flying cloud. Huge. This is what we need, but we need it to drive. This thing doesn't drive, does no, it? No, but you can hook it up and then drop it down. That's what you want. You'd be able to pull it with that truck, though? Easily. Easily. Bring the keys down tomorrow. No! This is, uh, so that was a tease. This is the coolest thing ever. I always like these. So, like, all the wind, like, everything. It's got this badass hatch in the back. Where are you taking it on a trip? Uh, I left the lights on. You can look inside. Uh. So this opens up, this is a hatch. Oh my god, this is big. Oh look, yeah, I think I left it alive. Yeah. 
super big. No, what? you didn't. This is like the one from Grimm. Yeah. <laughs> See, look at this, man. It's got like a screen that comes down, the table comes out. This is sick in here. It's got like a wicked queen size bed. There's two TVs back there. I don't even know how to turn them on now. Oh. Freaking kick ass sound, sound system. All like LED lights. This thing is badass. Two air conditioners, two solar panels, <laughs> with a freaking Wi Fi anywhere hotspot. Wow. Right? Yeah. yeah this is, this nice. is a perfect this great so cool. And you don't have to have it if you don't want. Like, you show up, no, no, you can like, drop can go, it like, off, off, and grid. then take your truck wherever after that. Exactly. That's the thing. You like, once you like, once you unload, and, you know, and it takes like, it takes less than 20 minutes for me by myself to get it like set at camp. Wow. So it's got freaking hookups. No, yeah, this 50, is the real deal. 50 amp hookup, cable TV if you want it, my water source, all needs to come down everywhere. You gotta, gotta have get it. one of these. Gotta get babies. one. All right, this is what we got going on. You guys saw it. He just gave us a whole walkthrough. So it's really not that bad, um, but it is a lot of stuff at the same time. Like it's not too crazy, but at the same time it's crazy. Like just this whole room here is, uh, you know, pretty aggressive. So like, that's what I'm claiming. Like we could load up anything small into the truck. I would say load up what and like maybe we can sell person. that small. Do you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Well, like even I feel like that's really, like I, sell or scrap. This is easy to put in there. Do we have, and then is we, there can, sticky notes we can on take one of these pictures of this stuff and price it super low. So um, that maybe literally maybe may sell by it. tonight or tomorrow. Do you know what I mean? But what? Everything in here except these. So Sammy J freaking called it. Won the bet. Wood furniture, just like she was saying, like antique wood I'm furniture. Start money on you this knew this week. style. This is like the stuff they had at. Uh, I, it even smells how I thought it was gonna smell. Only because of that oxygen net. I'm so happy he was talking about keeping the uh, the couches Me and stuff. Too, because this is a full blown thing. I thought it all looks like easy, especially when it's on like film. Oh my gosh, it's so much But work. for people who actually do this... The only thing is, all the furniture yeah. in here stays. So, like, no wonder Joe wants this table. He's going to... Because it's mid-century and it's so nice. Because he's going to sell it. Nice. Yeah, he is. Who wouldn't? Joe would not sell this. Dude, Does he do that? Yeah, I would. This stuff is no bad, way. dude. Joe would... No, no, he's definitely probably keeping this. It's really nice. Anything that he wants out of here after the summer, we take. The problem is it's not the solid, solid good stuff. Wait, he said this all stays. Right? Everything stays but what you got on your pictures. Everything in here stays except this. Oh, none of this goes. Oh, perfect. Do you know what I'm saying? All right. Nice. What claims are being made right now? I don't even what is this. Is this like a TV charge? I don't like this thing. No, yeah, that's a toilet pot. I know. It's boring. Damn. It is a TV charge. It is a tray that would come up next to the bed. <laughs> Which is kind of creepy. But. Honestly, though, like this, these pieces oh, of furniture no. that he's not getting rid of, like this might be worth money, dude. I don't want to deal with it because, like, if we had to get this out of here by tomorrow, but I'm saying, what would we do with it? He just is this just collectively from like other properties and they put it in one? Room? No, somebody that lived here. So, so this chair, we've come across this before, but. <coughs> Excuse me. That's rude. Sorry, guys. I just ate a mad soup. Um. Wow. Everything's not in that crazy condition either. No, nah, these people cared about their stuff. I can see that. This is a mid-century piece, huh? Yeah, we can bring that down. Wow. That might be a sellable piece. Hmm. What is that for? It's for like paperwork. It's kind of legit, but it's just like. No, that's so nice. It's super cool, but it. Right, how, oh, I guess I can. Leather it briefcase. All right. So far, keeping this. Either for scissors and packing supplies or maybe for Sammy's cosmetic situation. We're not sure yet. Getting into the first room, we're realizing the potential. I just posted the filing cabinets. All for $40. Already got hits on them, obviously. Look how cool they are. Two of these filing tables that are like wood. This nice desk I just put up. I think that'll sell by literally in the next 20 minutes probably because it's so cheap. So we got to have everything in here. Out of here by the weekend. And this thing is so sweet, dude. This thing is so cool. Super cool. 
honestly I would take that myself. This table was this heavy. Oh my gosh, that's a dream table though. Twenty bucks. Get get it up online right now. You know what I mean? Well, I'm not there. I'm not gonna get too crazy with it, but I the. I did find this though, and it does lock. It has two two keys. There's nothing in it, but um, for us, I think it would be very, very convenient. Uh, yeah, to keep so precious stuff in there. But also, like <laughs> somebody who's bosses. Yeah, but it's kind of like out of sight, out of mind. Like, if you just... Like, it's a burden. I'm saying, like, if you just put in the stuff in there. So, nothing except for what's in the middle of this room. And this pile right here is going... I thought this was interesting, though. Did they lose electricity in here? Mm -hmm. I was wondering, they had these two... Like, did they lose electricity in here? <laughs> I would drink in here, too. I just don't know. Um, it's kind of scary in here. This kind of has a very strange energy. And it's scarier in here than it is downstairs. I don't really like the energy, actually. Because, like, I can tell. You can feel it when you come out of each room. It's so thick you can cut it with a freaking knife in that room. That's why I've been chilling out here. Like, the lights don't really make a difference because I turned the light on there thinking I would feel different, but... Mm -mm. All right, we got these two cabinets. I'm about to post them on Facebook. I opened one up, though. And look what I found. So the previous owners of this house are no longer. But uh dog tags. And I'm gonna keep those for I don't want them getting thrown away. Actually I'll keep them in this box too. Because that's something that should never end up in the trash. And then uh we use envelopes pretty often, actually. So, I think these will be a pretty easy sell. And I have someone I know that actually wants to find a cabinet. So I told him to roll over here. He lives in AC, too. We can put him in our truck and then bring him over to his house. I don't know. He didn't say anything yet. So, we'll see. Why does this feel like a ghost hunt? With this funny. lamp on my head, too. And this stained glass and this photo. It's not funny. Oh, wow. Oh. The cross isn't making me feel any better either. Well, it's making me feel better. I'm just saying, it's like not like the actual cross. I'm saying, like, it's like something. The fact that they movie. had to have it there, right? That cross mixed with this carpet with that bathroom with that thing on the bed that i keep thinking someone wow this bathroom's really cool actually look at this look how cool this is the babies could sit look like if they had cats wow that's they so would cool. never they would during the there's day, a window they would never i love sit that. there when we were in it it's actually kind of not like a big bathroom but it's like the style was on point for the time period though i bet you I'm liking that, not the wall piece, it is weird. Like that lamp, though? The overhead lamp? And the seashell shaped sink? I'm thinking, would any one of you guys rock this bathroom? Because I would. I would. What else is actually even going? Nothing, actually. Just those two, but that one's broken. And like, none of this stuff is, uh, like. No, that's like of any value at all. Like he wasn't kidding when he said it was trash. He the office had the best stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because this is all trash too. And these shelves I wouldn't even give to someone. It wouldn't even be fair. He's claiming leave this light, this, this TV. Mm -hmm. They're not going to want that TV. Do they gonna have iPads to ever rent this place and just be watching this? You're true though. I don't know. I wouldn't even be happy if I rented this place. Mm. Personally. Uh, yeah, probably not. Probably not. Wow, I don't know. Who knows what else is in here? Alright, we're about to do some work on this job, but we stopped here to get dinner real quick. And last time we went to get pizza, people asked where it was. This is the place. I don't know. It's new here in AC. 
But uh, I'm about to show you guys this pizza real quick. That's what it looks Ooh, like. The steam. the steam just coming all of it. The doors are in. Yeah, the Jersey pizza is where it's at. It though. is. I mean, I'm starting to realize New Jersey food is where it's at. Trying to get some shirt orders done because uh, we got a big job tomorrow to do. But uh, Todd Hollingshead, I just want to shout out all the people who bought shirts. Uh, Mark McGowan, Deborah Reasoner, Cody Cockrum. We got Nikki Lynch, Joseph Jones. These are the ones that are already packed. We got Mark Colson. Sorry if I pronounce anyone's names wrong. We got David in Frisco, Texas. Mark Miller and Gary. I think I shouted you out already in the other one. But uh, we're going to try to get to get to work here and do some orders because this stuff gets you know way ahead over our heads sometimes when we got too much going on but i really with the reason that we want to shout people out when they order stuff is because we really really appreciate um every single order and these this is like when people ever ask how they can support the channel this is how uh our merchandise is one of our most important things that we have going on so thank you again so much for everyone who's ordered i'm going to put a time lapse on and do you know, as many as I can do until I get too tired. All right, this is kind of important. Yeah, well, it's important for us. So, Mark Snell, Schnell in New York, he ordered two large shirts. But I wanted to go back to an email that he sent us a little bit ago. And he donated a bunch of money to a cat charity for us when our cat Arlo passed away. Um, but he sent me an email and he wanted to uh, just put this out there. He was talking about the clean out video. And then he said, keeping it busy here in upstate New York, still, still volunteering at the CNYCC. Feral kitty season is right around the corner, so I'm doing a GoFundMe for a bunch of traps and carriers for our foster team. Feral kitties are a big problem in nearby Syracuse. All are uh, spayed and neutered, and ones that can be socialized into an adoption program go into an adoption program. We have a ten year. We had a 10-year-old kitty adopted last week. You, That's awesome. 20 plus adoptions at the center I volunteer at so far this month and over 900 adoptions for 2020. That's amazing. So his thing is Central New York Feral Cats Trap Neuter Release organized by Mark Schnell and he has a GoFundMe that looks like this. And if I can remember, I'm not really sure. Okay, here it is right here. Central New York Feral Cat TNR. I will put a link to it if I can remember. I hope I remember um, in the description of this video so that people can donate if they want to. So that is important. Super important. Rue, come back. So I'm going to pack his up and then Chuck Bodam. Um, another day in paradise, my friends. That's the message he left. So thank you, Chuck. You're the man. And then Luke Ann Rogers left a message. Thanks, talking Sammy, your lifelong fan. Luke Ann Toys, toy photography. The boy. Track of Martin. You guys are both so inspiring. Keep living the dream with a peace sign. And then we got Lana Haney. You guys are the best. Love you to the moon and back. Thank you. We got Dorothy Cullen. Love your YouTube. Thanks for sharing. And then Ryan Max said, can't wait to roll around with my five kitties in this fresh ass shirt. Love you guys. The dream. Michael Dunn, thanks to you both. Scott Jarvie, I can't wait to get that shirt. Sweet. Rick Murphy said, fans Rick and uh, Elvira, keep dreaming. Uh, David Rodriguez said, I really enjoyed watching your videos. It is just so obvious that you and Sammy J enjoy what you do. Enjoy what you do. I wish you all... <clears throat> young couples would emulate the hard work that you and Sammy put forth. Congrats on your success and well wishes for you and Sammy in the future. David, thank you. Appreciate that.
Kerry Pavkov uh, has ordered before. Uh, Kerry Pavkov. Sorry. Love these. Keep up the amazing work. Kerry. Thank you, Kerry, so much. Um, let's keep it going. I'm just going to pack these ones and then keep it going. All right, we are rolling. What's up? Good morning, everyone. So it's the next day, obviously, and we got rained out last night. We were going to go back to the house, but we just ended up coming home instead after we got pizza. And now I'm packing up the packages that we got to send out. I've been trying to do like, you know, 20 a day so that they don't get too overwhelmed with packages because so many people ordered stuff. And then we're heading over to the job in a few minutes. And we have our friend, this guy I knew for a few years. Well, like five or six years I've known him. Uh, he's a local dude and he's going to help us do the clean out. So that's cool. And they're putting a new roof on across the street. That's pretty nice. But yeah, I'm going to take these to the post office. Come back, grab the trailer grab Sammy and then onward to another day of cleaning out houses the dream yo what's up how are you Here it is. I can, I'll show you what we got. You can lock your bike up and then I'll show you what we got going on. All right, so really the best case scenario would be if the trailer was in here. Is that go -Pro? Yeah, I was just trying to think of where the best, uh, the best place to put the trailer so we can load it up. Yeah, right? it's, uh... So some of this stuff is gonna be getting sold mm -hmm. slash not thrown out. Right. But everything in this room's going. Okay. All this stuff, okay. not that. Okay, that's still that stays almost cool. everything in here stays okay. for the most part, but all this is trash. Okay. So basically, we're gonna just take all these boxes, everything that's like actually trash, and we're gonna just put it in the trailer. Okay. And then some of the stuff we're gonna salvage. And if you want anything that's in the trash piles, you can take it. I don't right. care. Right. I think everything in here stays. Okay. So it's really not that much, but uh, there is a basement area. Hey, and then uh, so I'll just show you so you get an idea in your head. So this room's trash, all that stuff. And then just the two cabinets, the two like shelves in there are trash, and that's it, I think. No, they're they're done. They're like it's just. Those two, and oh, then... I, lo I love the I love the uh, little <laughs> braces. <laughs> they're uh, how cheap can you get? Yeah. All right, and then. How are you down? Oh, pretty good. Pretty good. Unemployment just ran out on me. Maybe I might get me more. I don't know how to get these. Everything's staying in this room except for like these. Oh, wait, yeah, right. I thought those were so cool. He's keeping that for some reason. I guess to have it furnished for the next, like, runners or something. And then everything in this room goes. So, yeah, we can, anything, all this stuff we can just bring down. And then I'm going to position the trailer somewhere closer, I guess. And then I got. There he is, Steve Strongheart, everyone. Going for it. All right, he's got that. I think, uh... Yeah, it's not too bad. 
These are actually, uh, these were, oh, wait, wait. I'm sorry, I wanted to go through that one. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah. These were actually like super cool mattresses at one point. Yeah. The boy's no joke out here. You're good. like to read uh not much i mean i do like it but i don't get time to too busy either doing this or when i get home i always just want to relax yeah right but i don't watch uh foreign films i want to read the book <laughs> what do you got to read i, mean, I got a little short book it's about 150 pages yeah. what is it it's a book is called uh kinship with all life kinship with all life yeah. is that how you live See, you're going through what I was going through. Yeah. And that's a Bible right there. I think. Oh no, it's not, but it's a cool encyclopedia. Dictionary, I should say. This was a cool box. This one's got Alright, this guy's the master of state saving space here. We got the master of saving space. Yeah. Yeah. Comes with being a teamster, you know. And having moved like 40 times myself, you know. Yeah. That's what I was thinking, right? Yeah, right? It might start raining, but. Yeah, it was supposed to rain. It's it actually supposed to stop in uh, the afternoon. So far, we got our buddy Steve Strongheart on the crew. Really good worker already. I'm impressed. Very impressed. Um, just a local guy that I've known for a while never was close to him but just acquaintance and he offered to do the job with us so here we are getting it done so all this is basically trash but even this like you were saying this is not bad no i thought that was really cool i would say and this the then like i guess most of these boxes are What is in it? I guess because it's literally just like newspapers. Well, actually, oh, get that out of here. So stuff like this, tape, screwdrivers, hammer, like this one box right here. It'd be key fly. These are all bags we can use for something. I was thinking these vacuum and two bags here are like a donation pile. The chair, I think we're gonna use for something, for a scene. But then we got like, you know, treasures. All right. Hoping that this will be enough light to see what we got in here. Oh wow, no way. All right, so look what I just found. It is a special detective badge from Atlantic City, New Jersey. And if I didn't go through this box, that would have just been ended up in the trash. So 
really unbelievable find, actually. This opens up. This is a drawer. That's, mm -hmm. that's, yeah, What's this? That's a king. Someone's ass. Is it, though? Yeah. Oh, it's got a lanyard, too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. No, no, it's not a king. What it's is something it? Else. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. It's Does got, it um, open? It's like got a fibers sword, in there. dude, or something. It's got fibers. Oh, watch out. What is, oh, you know pop? what? This might be an umbrella. No a way. Fancy umbrella. Yeah. What? This, this is a fancy umbrella. Get it open. Hold on a second. This guy There's has a, quality. I thought it was a king, right? No, Me too. Because there was like, we, th we threw them out. Yeah, this is. Oh, Oh, right. oh, I see. There we go. Yeah. Wait, right. how, do you, how does it open? Okay, well, I guess um, from now you gotta. <laughs> this guy does quality, right? Point, but, uh, or... I wouldn't have thought that was on bro. There we go. Yeah. There you go. Wait, a... but how do you. Okay, hold on. How does it go down, though? Well, <laughs> I think it'll just go down as soon as you. Make it the stuff we find it's cleaning out yeah. houses. It's an inside out umbrella. Yeah, well, no, no, this is a, one of those from down. like just... like the umbrella from yeah. My Fair Lady. This is, looks like a tennis no, shot waiting to happen. Yeah, right? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is what it looks like. Yeah, I, I don't get that anymore. I don't get any of those shots. No. You don't want the... I don't want any of the shots, no. Nah. He had to get a tetanus shot though because he's stuck yeah. in a rusty nail. I don't know if something's... That is right. a really cool... As long cool... as we know it's an umbrella and not a cane. What does it say? That's made a cool there? umbrella. You're going to need that today later. <laughs> oh, made in Italy. So that's kind of... Mamma mia! <laughs> Mamma mia! So this... It... It is uh, broke. No, it's good. You can refix that. Yeah. I could it's do that. That's not a throw-out piece. That's a... No, it's kind of cool. Yes. Yeah, yeah. You think you'll find another one of those today? Because <laughs> I never saw one of those in, in my whole life so far. So, so, lady, so obviously, the lady's Italian. Yes, yes exactly. Yeah. So, like, if I mean, you're trying to attack her on the street, makes sense. The yeah. dude that lived here uh, was like a big part of AC, like politics and stuff okay. like that. He has a day was, named uh, after him and stuff. He's got a what name? Like a day, an official day named oh, after really? him. Really? Wow. He was a detective. All oh, this stuff. Okay, yeah, Head of the so, school board. All like. Yeah. Been here forever. Yeah, well, there's there's basically two, two, two sets of cops in the land city: the Irish and the uh, Italians. <laughs> Is that how it rolls? Yeah, that's how it rolls, you know. Damn, those yeah. are good to keep. Yeah, these are kind of cool. I actually feel bad. You got to go stuff through out. this stuff because you got to see what I found. You got you got the Calios and the Connollys, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's true though. I knew it. Right? So, yeah. All right, so we're here in Atlantic City. We're cleaning out this house. Not everything goes, but. We just came across a crazy umbrella and I wanted to show you guys what I found. What'd you find? So I was in here and I was like, oh, this box looks interesting. Popped it open, this little tin. <gasps> that and box is really cool. I was like looking in here and look, special detective badge. Oh my gosh. Yes. That's, That's pretty detective. cool, right? Yeah. I like that. <laughs> yeah, that'll get you out of a parking ticket. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong, though. Maybe, You're not wrong. <laughs> that's a, that's a <laughs> killer <laughs> score, that right there. This is a really cool box. Oh. I like that box. I got to show you my wallet. Oh, he wasn't. What's your wallet? See through. Oh. Milk crate. Milk, milk bottles. You made it? Yeah, I made it. Milk Makeshift. bottles. Makeshift. So, yeah. yeah. That is really cool, actually. What do you mean milk? Oh, like an actual Yeah, yeah I, cut, I cut out my milk bottles. I, you know, like I made a mask out of it once, and I made, um, so I figured there's got to be something I could do with this stuff, you know? It's and like, he made it. You know, if I had a kiln and, uh, and a way to evacuate the vapors, you know, I'd probably, uh, <clears throat> I'd probably make some neat stuff. Commissioner. Well, you he was commissioner. A commissioner. Commissioner. A detective. Mm. He, he, had, he, he was in charge of the, the bat light. <laughs> <laughs> he knows. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that was the killer score that, right? That's super what else do we have in here? What do you got? Some goodies? We got that. <clears throat> Those are great scales. Really I got, cool. I got two of them. Mine, mine's for, for a while, for the longest while, mine was broken. It was stuck on 200 pounds. Now, it's, now it goes up to 220. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good one. Good one. So that was probably the big score. The of best the one. I was hoping. But for you just some... found some seriously cool hats over there. Same yeah. The score. What is this? Something. Oh, dust. A lot of dust. Another wallet thing. Yeah. What's this? What is this? That's like a raincoat, right? 
Hey, that might come in handy. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah. USA. Oh, USA. That's actually I've been your size. This your size. <laughs> you hear this? <laughs> Look at this, though. This is for leaving. He this wants to leave leaving. this stuff, but look at this yeah. dish, these dishes. Oh, yeah, that's... Uh-oh. This is... That? The, the... Look at these. That's why this is going to rattle. The chances yeah. of uh, this okay. people that come and rent this place drinking out of these is like 100%. They're going to be yeah. like, oh, get the yeah, fine right? dinner where... <coughs> yeah, right? <coughs> now you got to find something to drink out of it. No chips or anything, see. This one's... Here, it's not a hanger. That is for. Uh, what was that for? Do you know what this is? For hanging your clothes up, you know. So you, you empty your wallet and you put your you put your jacket on, right? You, know, you think that's hanger. a you think that's a yeah, sellable piece? No, you're right. It might it might be actually good. Yeah. You know, yeah, just the way defer is like. Um, yeah, defer trash, you know. Yeah, that's pretty good right there. Just these little babies right here, right? Yeah. Let me just take this stuff out of here. Uh, yeah, there's some stuff. What else were you looking for? Similar like this or? Chairs, looking for a kitchen table. The kitchen table's staying here. Um, I can show you what else we got though. Dave, just said the, the trick. Like, what like happened? Two hundred dollars there one time. Tell him. Right. So you can throw it out. You look. See if anybody Ooh. taped any. You tape. Sorry about that, Sam. <laughs> you tape. Yeah, somebody might have taped like their extra money here, so nobody steals it. You know, like they're. You're like, uh, so that, was, could, could that was uh feathers yeah, it not like dust it's so, really crazy so yeah yeah, just, yeah you might want that's to check that that's, sometimes, that's a you know, good trick it'll be a thousand drawers you, you check before you find one but no yeah you're that's... gonna find one sooner or later at one point in your life you will find a, an antique know. umbrella it might, it might only be a hundred dollar silver ticket <laughs> well we got to give them this It does roll, but and also they're not really that heavy either. Hey, you want to get it? You got it? You know what? Let me uh, get up to the step. Yeah. And then I'll get the side. Yeah, I can just get half of it if you want. Yeah, that'd be good. Let me just get the bottom. Okay. Oh. Oh. You staying in the area? Or are you going? Uh, uh. No, we live in Summers Point. Oh, okay. This is a real estate company that we're doing the clean out for. Oh, okay. And he's renting it out. Yeah. He's the dude that owns Sotheby's and Margate. You got that? Yeah. Okay. Sammy J. Found the unicorn of all unicorns. Straight up. That hat, the police badge, dog tags, we're scoring all day in here. Very cool. Where are the doggies? Where are the dog tags? Where are the dog tags? Oh, I, I, I put on. I'll take it out to make it easier. You know? Yeah, no, for sure. Well, I'll I mean, take down all these. Because we didn't really, uh, we didn't have that much stuff left. Mm -hmm. uh, I forget, what did I post them for? Was it 20? Let me look because I don't remember. Yeah, I posted please. like 500 things this week already. Good. You know what? It's a good hustle. It's a great hustle. A little back breaking, but it's like young and strong. Uh, 30 I had them on there for okay, you. Cool. I knew I had to have the 10. But uh, I'm sorry about the message. I, I It did seem like I was saying I was taking them to you, but no worries. Bad. No worries. Yeah. Keep, stay strong. Keep on moving. Yeah, you got it, yeah, right? Right now, I think you're going to be uh, constantly busy. Look at the picture and everything else. That's... Uh, Pretty cool, right? It's a print or a real picture? It's a print, it's a shame. Wow, this is actually really cool. Look at this. Yeah, it's a cool job. What do we got? So like, it just looks like a regular, just crappy dress, like 
whatever you call that. And then you open it, and it's like... It's like a bar. It's really cool. Yes, a nice piece. Like, if you cleaned it up, I would paint it. I might it's actually... a little bit smoked, but... No, but you could... This it's all stays, but this is some seriously nice stuff. That's beautiful. And light, so light. nice and so heavy. Yeah, that's the whole thing is it's like I think as you keep doing this you'll kinda of like pick up what where the value is and yeah. there's a lot of money to be made. Look at this thing. The man. sad part about it is that like this guy was like, You guys get in there, we met him here tomorrow and he's like, You get get it done tomorrow if you can. And we it's like in here yesterday, yeah. Or yeah, last night. And it's like I if these had to go, I couldn't bear to throw them out. Do you get what I'm saying? So like, That's what do you, we try what do you do? Facebook marketplace, but at home we don't have <coughs> any space to even store stuff. You know what? Just keep on doing what you're yeah, doing, and you'll fall into the guy that has the space. Yeah, and, you got to keep trucking. That's the real. That's, that's the real all. claim. And I think you're in a. I think you're in a spot and an industry right now where there's business. You know where you always stay busy because yeah, so much movement right now with people coming there's, and going. And there's like a lot of waste in this specific area. People just throw stuff out that is like brand new. Yeah, and it's because they have deep, deep pockets. You know, it's okay for them to spend that money. For us, we're like, yeah, I could use it. I'll work with that. But no, some people all they want is new, new, new. And thank God for them, they keep. Uh, no, we like. I the don't know the, um, turning. I don't know the feeling because I've never been rich, but I always thought I would be. The person that would just like to salvage it regardless though because well, the older stuff the cooler stuff really yeah they don't do the work like that anymore but hey thank you man i appreciate it yeah there's not much else here. up there which way am i going out right this goes out yeah all right, right have man. a good one be dude well thank you what's the call me opening the windows it feels good down here because like since the heat rises it's just so stuffy up there especially with the carpet Oh, so this is coming out, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. They're, they're night vision, but they're also like you can wear your regular glasses. What does that mean, though? Night vision, like you. Well, they they um, they're not they're not tinted, so they don't block any light, right? They're just they're um they're dyed, so they filter light instead of blocking it, you know. So there's not particles in there that actually blocks light. It just filters light, so certain colors get through. What is this for? It's pretty cool, actually. So we got the Homer Simpson Moo Moo, right? The well, lounge that's, around. That's for the. Um, that's a. That's a sewing machine, probably. It might be for a sewing machine or a uh, paper shredder. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what do we got there? That makes sense. Yeah. That's, that's nice. not. That's not old though. Oh, what are those sweatpants? Sweaties. Too big. Yeah, you want them too? We got special value. Okay. When it gets sunny out tonight. Happy it's holidays here, right? cards. What's this? Nothing good. No vintage gold, right? Nothing yet. Nothing yet. Until you come across that one T. Oh, what's that? I like that. It's kind of cool. What's this? Property of HCSC. Damn, I kind of like it, so I'm going to keep it. Sweaties. Sweaties? Those are too short. Mm -hmm. And then that's just all. I'm keeping the Moo Moo, because I think that's a classic. Damn, I was really banking on some gold vintage. This is good. It's got a logo, you know? So. Hmm. Kind of looks sort of like an anchor and a cross at the same time. Here you want some freshy pears? These there are totally been open. Oh no! <laughs> this guy knows. Some Coca Colas. This is a nice. There's a like a cool bee. That, that, and then the Coca Cola. It's gonna be trash. This guy knows quality. So that's pretty much what the carpet looked like when they put it down. Yeah. And that's what it looked like after a couple decades. <laughs> yeah, decades, yes. This needs to come out bad. Yeah. Who's got that job? Not me, thank yeah. God. Okay. I think he's renting it like that. Really? Wow. 
late rental, I guess. He'll probably, uh, he'll probably clean it or something, maybe. Or he's got someone coming to take it out. I mean, I would do it, but I don't want to. Yeah. I've done it before. Yeah. All right, so I got like the little stuff on the floor, so it's just these. Two. So if we just. Oh, wait, grab if, that, that little piece and you can well, it I think uh, if we just get these, I mean, unless it's just easier to take them apart. Because these are. Because yeah, this just comes apart so easily. Yeah, right? I'll go back up, you guys can just leave the, um, the and stuff. Do you know what I'm saying now? Yeah, yeah. That's a really wild leg, like Lego style. Yeah, right? Kind of, kind of nice when it does that. For moving it around, yeah. Oh. <laughs> She's not playing up there. The organization of this guy's trailer upper. I, know, that's, I was just thinking that too. Getting it done though. His, uh, I like the, um, the energy he brings to the table. Yes, is. Is this guy like a physicist or something? I'm, uh, I'm confused. Might as well be. I like uh, being surrounded by people I can learn from. So we could put these in here if you want, or turn it. Yeah, that would be cool. In my little lockbox. Really too. Right there little lock box so yesterday I was I thought there's something in it but there wasn't but it has the keys yeah, so nice I'm always fascinated by a box that can lock I don't know why I've been like that since I was little I guess all girls are like that maybe it's like you have like your secret stuff in it yeah well you can't fit river in there so for me it's kind of... she's not a secret my box Really? Because it looks like it says K's, K's box. box, but somebody taped that on there. I don't know why. Sammy J's box. Sammy K. I'll get you it could just off. put Sammy K. I'll make it Bruce box or Ooh, oh, I know we can sissies. do. We can make it like one of those um things and you could write something in it and then put it no, I didn't dig a hole it. and like a time capsule. Mm -hmm. We could do that. What are you doing? Make a the, time. Making the energy better. Make a time capsule. I was capsule? thinking we can make a time capsule out of this. You oh. know. Hmm. Like put it in the yard no, for like it's not a decade. Oh, you know, I've been I've been having a recurring dream mm -hmm. of uh, I had a uh, when I was like four years old. I buried a box like this in the ground, like between my house and a neighbor's house, right in the backyard. Mm -hmm. Had like pennies and nickels, buffalo head nickels. Yeah. And, and G.I. Joe's and you know, like army men and stuff, you know. And I, I keep thinking about that thing. Where? You never dug it up? It's in Patterson, so. So you can't be creeping around someone's yeah, yard right. trying to dig it up like one of my dog captures in your I'm yard. Sure it was gone after 50 some odd years. You never know though, how deep did you dig it? You remember? What's that? How deep did you dig it? <laughs> I was four. <laughs> Not deep then. Not we need deep. to go on a treasure hunt, it sounds like. All right, we're going to Patterson after we're done. The mystery of Steve Strongheart's four-year-old treasure. <laughs> Time capsule. So what would you call it? Antique? Vintage, maybe? Yeah. Wood cabinet with yeah. tile top. It's a trapezoidal cabinet. Trapezoidal. Yeah, there we go. Is that what that would call? 
Yeah, well, that's the shape of the, uh, the top of the trapezoid. Are you a uh, physicist these days? Yeah, I'm a physicist. I'm a mathematician. I am a musician. I am a, an electrician, a electrical. Man of all trades. You know, computer programmer. Should I, should I title it Trapezoidal Cabinet? Yeah, Trapezoidal Cabinet. I mean, just because it sounds better than just like a, a weird shaped cabinet, right? So with these jobs, I like to just film a lot, show you guys how we do them. Uh, we're about, I don't know, maybe halfway through, but we might do part two. We're not sure yet. Uh, it might be broken into two videos, probably will be. Um, we're doing pretty good on time here though. And it really is hard to film and do it at the same time, but I try. <laughs> that's all, that's all. I mean, this is, this is nice. this is really useful. you can add that if you want it. This one's place, trash, I think. The one I, the one I have is okay. You need the rope? What were you just tripping about? Look at this. What? That toaster, uh, dude. The Mary Proctor toaster. <laughs> oh, I'm liking that. No, look at this. What is it? All right, do you, in your in your humble opinion, did DJ come back here? No, absolutely not. Since we were here and I today. I DJ ain't gonna come back here at night. It's creepy here. Well, then why did all the canes end up right there? Stacked perfectly. Just tell me. How? Unless he was here. Wait, you're right, because his daughter didn't come back to, because she's going to donate this. Wait, are you kidding, dude? Did you put them there? No, unless he did. And wouldn't he have turned off this? And that light of yours here? No, but the canes are weird. There's no way DJ came back here. We gotta ask him. Set, we gotta settle this, because otherwise, yeah, that's, this. that's too much for me to handle. All right, now ask the boy. He didn't do it. How do you know? He you would never here, do that. He, they weren't, it, they weren't, I was looking for him earlier, they weren't around. How do you know though, are you sure? He didn't do that, he I'm would never do around. that. Why would I do that? Come here, did you put these here? Oh, the, the, Canes? No, no, no. Are you lying? No, no, no I didn't put them there, no. no, no, no. Why are you smiling then? No. <laughs> <laughs> Why would he put them there? What do you mean? That's is, so creepy. There's no way is, that he came back here and put them there. How'd they get there? I don't know. Wait, didn't I put them in there? Yeah, that wolf head. Ooh, it was a part of this Collins cane, but it's there. just... They were all over the place. It's about the right size, I guess. And on the ground. Huh. Huh. So somebody put in there? I didn't do it, no. Yeah, but we were here until like... We were here last night. Nine o'clock last night, and then nobody's been and here since. And the broker definitely didn't come here. Unless he did, unless he did. In this morning? I don't know yet, today, maybe. Yeah, well, yeah, maybe you know. It was creepy. How big is that door? That's, uh, that's, that's 42 yeah, inches. That's, 42. that's the biggest door I've seen yeah, ever. I've not seen a door. That's, that's the kind of, you know, that's you bring got... the piano in, you know? Right. <clears throat> How much do you think that door's worth? To the right buyer. That's that's gotta be like you know well, to uh, to sell it to sell it. If you wanted to buy that to put in this this hole, fill this hole, and you're looking at like five hundred dollars, you know. Mm -hmm. um, if you wanted to sell this to somebody. Why they have um, brown though? But it has yeah. the actual. Where's the key at? Yeah. Because they brass. just ma they it's matched all, it to this. Brass. So you, the, you get, you get, you can make key. To the siding. They you matched it. it to the siding. The brown is so good. Yeah, but that's what the house looked like. Yeah. Like I mean, it's painted. Like these these keys are so insecure, and that's why they changed them to like Because, like, like, like you, this, someone you know? could just pick them, right? Even well, though I know how to pick a regular they're, they're lock. Mechanically, a little bit harder. Where are those, harder those skeleton keys that are probably super cool? I want one. Yeah. Love they're the they're, they're pretty much warded um, keys. So like, what, what that means is like it has things that stop you from moving, and if you get in between those, then it works. You know, so. So Plus, they're now so good. They're, they're yeah, somewhat they're not, generic too, right? Like if you have the same door. Yeah. Instead of like. <clears throat> well, I I you know, like like um quick culture. quick set. They guarantee that like you know um, on some of their keys or cheaper key locks, they guarantee that there won't be another key that fits it for five hundred locks. So in other words, you got you got, you got a development. If you have a development with like 500 houses, chances are that you know two will fit. And <laughs> that's, that's a, that's a would ever, ever you'd have heard. to go try a lot of houses before you got yeah, that. Yeah, right. That's that's the point, you know. But 
because of that, and because like a, you know, like in the development, they'll also it'll divide that by two, and it, because what they'll do is they'll master key um, the lock, so like the guy, the contractor can go in any house with one key. He doesn't have to have a whole ring of keys, right? Well, that so, makes sense. Okay. So that means that each each um, each uh, pin, each set of pins has two positions that opens it. So that means it's a lot easier to get in. Um, when I was, uh, I lived in such a place when I was a teenager, and my neighbor, my friend locked himself out. So he comes over to my house and I said, well, let me see. You know, and I tried, I tried my key in his door. And it worked? And it worked, right? His key did not fit in mine. It wasn't uh, reciprocated. See, that's weird. Maybe you had the universal key without knowing it. Well, I, <laughs> the universal key. I think it just fit like his by accident. Do you think there's one key to rule them all that fits every yes, lock in the universe? Lock. Well, well, no, not every lock in the universe. <laughs> but but um, what they do, what they do do, is they'll cut a key down all the way down to the to the to the root, right down to the root, and just leave a little stub there, and you pop it in real quick. It's called a bump a bump key, right? And you put it in. What happens is the keys vibrate. You know, the pins inside vibrate and you just keep a little pressure on it and when they get into the right spot right if you keep doing that and you know, It'll just, just by random motion right the pins will s eventually line up and unlock. do you think you're like are you considered the key guy like the key master uh, the me? key man <laughs> like you know more about keys than anyone else i know uh, <laughs> all right i'm going to dj working off a limited battery here so hopefully it doesn't uh, run out of battery, but so everything almost down here stays almost except for this area here, which I think the TV might be. Well, we can't take that anywhere for trash anyway, so that's gonna have to be some kind of a keep life piece there. Disconnect all this stuff. Okay, I've got this noodle. And I'll clean up the trailer while I'm there. With that, all right? Yeah. What? This is door? That's just a nice little entrance way. So what, I don't remember what he said goes down here. Nothing. Oh, um, anyway. Those boxes, of course. This stuff right here in the corner? This, I guess. Oh, no, no, no. Let me get my... There's some nice furniture in this house, though, boys and girls. All this stays, though. Circular light tubes. Those are probably hard to find. Not hard to find, but probably expensive. Yeah, no. Wait, is it? Oh yeah, in here maybe. So that goes, so we're just gonna, me and him will take the TV and put that in the bed of the truck. And then the TV stand and all that stuff is just gonna be trash, I guess. Mm -hmm. And just then, this, thing, this was down here, right? That's in the kitchen, so, so that's that. easy. And then what about this stuff? What? Everything in here, yeah, that was down here. So all this. Hold on, it was this. Just those, right? Where's the, oh, you took the trash, right? Yeah, this, just these This two. looks too nice, yeah. yeah that this, stays this, in the ceiling this, tiles he yeah, probably You need drop ceiling tiles from this room, right? <laughs> Definitely. So, yeah, not much no, I, need, no, I need that. That's keepable. Oh, there were pillows I threw out. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> this one is a cool mirror, but it's it's probably gone, right? Done yeah, for. Yeah. This, is, this was super cool. This is a mid-century little yeah, dreamer, actually, dude. Your mom would want this. You gotta keep that. Just keep it and give it to her for Christmas. Yeah, this is cool. Yeah, it really is cool. And like it's not Actually, worth you know what? it's not worth that much. No, but this is keep life. It's definitely it worth worth keeping. All it has is just this. Yeah, that's fine. It can be fixed. Look at this. Old school. I knew it was gonna be a stay lauder. You guys that. need watch, to watch, 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 watch. Sorry. I don't know why you don't have this on. Mm, so we're going to keep this. Keep that. Okay. So this one's trash. Okay, what do we got here? 
I got this. Here, you got take, that? Take, take, yeah, just take that stuff. Right. And then everything else. And then let me get that white. Uh, I can get it. Oh, dang. These are, Those are all keepy keepies. You get some cool stuff in here, though. What's in here, though? <laughs> nah, nothing. What's in here, though? Getting my hoops up for nothing here. That's what I don't understand. Do you want to see some creepy stuff out of Oh, there's hand soap down here. I think that. We'll talk to him about what we need, what we're going to do later. I think he's trying to get the mass of it out and then deal with everything else later. Yeah, true. But, like, this is, uh, I'll be honest, less aggressive than I thought. Wait, less aggressive? I mean, the boy? Nailed it. Nailed it. All right, the big doggy TV. Yeah, right. This one's going to go in the bed of the truck. I guess it's Chinese doctor and says, Doctor, what can you do for me? He says, Well, yeah, you know, the American doctor says you can't do anything for me. <clears throat> but he cut it off for me. 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 Alright, so that was part one of our Atlantic City cleanout videos. And we have some things we want to show you. So let's check it out. So, this is the stuff we scored, some of our best finds. We really think that you can find the coolest stuff in cleanouts. So, I have these uh, pens. Oh, wait. Freshly sharpened pencils. I was like, freshly oh, sharpened yeah. pencils. Hello. Because, like, we have so many pencils, but, like, none of them are sharpened, and they just suck. But these ones are freshly sharpened, and there's cool pens in there. Can never have enough pens. We can, at least. You show them your doggy tags? Yeah. Because you know So, these are the two, these are my two favorite things that we got from the job, because they're immensely unique. Oh, and I forgot about probably that. Probably one of a kind. I mean. Let me go on this side, actually. I would have Light to say. So the dog tags, I guess you would say they're two of a kind. But these are super unique. Very cool. Like, never get that again. It's not something you can find. So funny. I used to have dog tags with my name on it. Did you ever have that? Yeah, like clay ones. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I don't. And then this. Special nice. detective. And it has the That's badge. Like it's upside cool. down, this piece. But it has like the badge of Atlantic City and like the crest, I guess. So those two things, incredible. And then, incredible. Should I show? Oh, yes. So I fixed, all it took was just a little bit of <laughs> reattaching the pieces. But look at this. Amazing. Ooh, watch out, boy, you tall. And this is probably like a $200. Very cool. Umbrella, if you can even find one. Made in Maybe Italy. 150. Where does it say? Marco Polo, made in Italy. Yeah. So I think I just. Think oh, we got that chair from there too. So unbelievable, the amount of cool stuff you can get in these places. Like, this stuff is better than what we find at auctions or storage units most of the time. Honestly. Should I show them my moo moo? Yeah, you can. I'll show them both of my moo moos actually. All right. So these are the moo moos, vintage moo moos. I thought, I thought they were cool. But uh, yeah, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, pretty please, and stay tuned for part two. You! Ruru. Ruru!